the 3D Silicon Canvas Man. What I've done, I've got these two old canvases and I've stuck them together. Stuck them together, a bit of sellotape now, but um, they'll be st properly stuck together when I've finished. And what I'm going to do, um, I'm going to experiment cutting out two holes in the canvas. Got to paint them white first. So now what we're doing now, we're going to cut two eyes in this canvas. Yeah, I've made the holes, I've made the holes with the scissors. So I've got to trim them up a little bit. Now it don't matter if you about trimming them up really because um, I'm making a kind of stick made holes for the nose and I'm just about to do the mouth. And now what I'm doing is um, getting some silicon and putting it into the holes. just use your finger to just go in and kind of make the eye sockets yeah I've got these ball balls from Christmas and I'm putting them in in the eye sockets set them right back Silicon nose. Mm -hmm. That's what it looks right from the side. Made silicon nose. I suppose they could, the eyeballs could be set back a bit. Let's try and push them back a bit. So what I'm doing now is the mouth. And this can's got a bit of a uh, hardboard on the back of it, so that's why I'm using drill. And now to make some lips out of the silicon. I'm going to give him some thick lips, I think. He deserves some thick lips. Oh, that might be a she. I don't know yet. Might be a she. Do is paint the eyeballs. Get a coat of paint in there. Sockets. There we go. The face is almost done. Just a little bit of touching up and uh, put some teeth in. I'm going to give him some teeth. So I'm just cutting some teeth out of this polystyrene. Right now I've stuffed the teeth in, the polystyrene teeth, into the face and I'm now going to use a heat gun on them to try and shrink them in to the canvas. See that one? Got to be careful with this because it's so hot. There we go, there's his teeth. Bit, uh, they need a bit of dental work doing to them. So now what we're going to do now is do a bit of dental work with the ma mastic gun, the silicon. Just getting some fillings, this poor lad. And maybe give another lad to it, give some Botox to his lips as well because his top lip is a bit thin. So we're going to give him some Botox there. At the same time, give him some dental treatment. Stick those uh, dentures in there. There we go. I'm going to cut this shirt down the back. Be stuck on. Uh, I'm going to 
go like that. Put pegs on that to keep that together. So it's going to go there. And while that's drying, I'm going to put the wig on. So I've got this like bald cap wig. I've cut it in half, so I can use that again for another another thing. And then, then that's going to go like that. Right, I've now stuck the ears on with polystyrene, so that they're holding in place with this tie. Right, what I've done now, as the ears are drying with a tie round, and I've got stuck the collar on onto the canvas, and I'm weighting it down now, and that will stay for about 20 minutes. I'm right, just about to do the polystyrene ears, try and get some shape to them. Put, I put the heat gun on low, so the earlobes are a bit got to be a bit. Nice one. And now I'm just about to give shape to the ears. Give it some plug holes. And I'm now painting on this, it's still wet, the silicon is still wet, but it seems to be having a better effect because I'm painting on it while it's wet, because so I can kind of shape it as I'm going. And I'm using burnt umber, red and white, and a touch of yellow to make it look a bit orangey. Going inside the ear now, so that's got to be a bit darker. Actually, a bit more darker. And even a bit of black. Get some black here. So get some definition now, because we're going inside. Kind of inside the ear, right inside the ear now. That's it. There we go. The 3D canvas man, silicon canvas man. I think I'm naming Ted. Got to finish off the ears and then he's done. But that's basically all finished. And there he is. Uh, well, thanks for watching watching I mean and uh, don't forget to hit the like button because the like button is what tells YouTube to give me more views so there we go there we go the 3d canvas man the 3d silicon canvas man uh, I might call him Ted and just straighten up is that straight is that straight yep is that straight there we go so gotta maybe do the ears a bit more um, but basically, he's done. Don't forget to hit that like button, and I'll see you next time. Thank you very much.